All right, I'm way too hooked on this. Way more than I thought it was going to be. Okay, right. I forgot, we've got this intro. I guess I could have... Yeah, I played this before. We know what we're doing. All right, there we go. So I'm back with the power of spreadsheets. Uh, so I've got a spreadsheet for every skill skill check in the game because I looked up... Uh, I, I looked up a guide. I'll, I'll own this just because there's so much. Uh, but so I looked up a guide and then copied what information they had. It's just a Steam guide, nothing fancy. Uh, copied what information they had. The problem is it's not a very good data set. It doesn't actually really show you much. Like, what is composure for? Well, I know it's for the snake. Um, same thing with the reflexes. Uh, but we know, based on their information... This music's a little loud for me. We know, based on their information, that a composure of 10 is enough to pass the snake, potentially? I thought it was higher than that. I also got a raspberry seed. I don't know. But that means I don't actually need that much composure to get anything done. I should probably pull up that, uh, that other guide for how do emotions affect, uh, all about moods and skill training. There we go. I've got a, I've got another one. I guess you guys can just follow along in this one. I'm just going to pull this up when I feel like pulling it up, uh, just because it's very important information and this way we're all on the same page. Uh, anyway, so... We have a whole bunch of different abilities here. So, I wonder if we fail both Composure and Reflexes, what happened? Because I'm pretty sure this is Snake on both. And maybe Poison? Though that's the following week. So I'm just going to write down Snake Aftermath. My entire point here is that I kind of want to do some data gathering. I'd uh, go through another round of this, but try and pay attention to, like, what's important, what's not. And, you know, a number of these might actually be like, hey, you fail this, you die. And so what I want to do is, is specifically go through this entire list, match, you know, the weak to the skill check and say, like, you know, hey, if I don't have... Oh, what's a good one? Somewhere. Um... I was looking for like a reflexes. Reflex and so reflexes and or sword on week 36. If I fail that, I die no matter what. I need to figure out where the true landmines are. Because this game is fairly flexible, but it's not that flexible. Um, you know, there's multiple routes, but there are a couple of like hard points where you might just die. Uh, the chocolate event, apparently from the last session, is uh, apparently a run killer. Uh, and a very common one, and a lot of people were actually surprised that I lived through it. So, with all of this in mind, let's actually start working on this. I'm thinking... Let me take a look at skills. So we've got... Uh, we've got a bonus to animal hat handling horses, dogs, and falcons. Now, looking at the, uh, the skills thing... I'm just gonna go through this. I'm, I'm gonna keep bringing it back up. If you scroll through this, horses is like... twice. Maybe. Uh, and dogs is like once and falcons also once yeah falcons is here and supposedly they passed it with a 10 so there's a very real possibility that I don't really need to bother with falcons that much so I might I might just put one round of one round into falcons and if I'm not mistaken, horses also had a maybe pass on 10. So I might just put one week worth of training into both horses and falcons just to see if I can pass those two. And if I can, then we know that that's all we need to do. Um, otherwise, beyond that, stuff like instrument. Instrument only happens once. Same thing with voice. There's, I think there are some other skill checks. I'm pretty sure this is actually an incomplete list because I mean they don't even have half of these filled in um but I'm I'm wondering if you know some skills are more useful than others so specifically meditation just is not on this list in the slightest uh running not at all I'm curious yeah same thing as swimming swimming is on it once and climbing is so I almost wonder if running is more of just a pro prerequisite of getting the other other two up uh but might not have its own tests or i don't know but either way it only shows up like once or twice i know like herbs supposedly doesn't show up at all and battlefield medicine might not either so there's like a couple of these that might not actually be worth uh investing time into at all and i kind of want to figure out 
if that's the case. So, for starters, let's uh, turn that off. We're going to put one into horses and one into falcons. And then we're going to start looking into uh, instrument or voice. Okay, animal handling, animal handling, falcons and horses. Okay, so let's grab both of those. We're severely depressed. Okay, it's the cousins. So we'll deal with that in a bit. Okay, so now what do we want to do? So here's the real question. What is my mood at? I am depressed. Depressed does not affect economics. I mostly just need to make sure that I don't become willful or pressured, uh, which could happen very easily. Uh, so it might actually be better that I become uh, yielding and lonely for the time being. Because what are what are our upcoming tests that we actually care about? There is poison, which is under medicine. Medicine is benefited by lonely, so that's good to know. And negative for angry. So I might want to mess with poison, kind of, uh, just to see if I can max that out. I know there's a couple of tests for poison that might be useful. Uh, but beyond that, the rest of it might not be good. I don't know. I don't know. I That's that's why I'm doing this. Okay. So we're going to do anything that makes me yielding lonely. And... Uh, I don't think there's a difference between... I don't think depressed affects economics. Uh, and we kind of want to get rid of depressed. Though it does help with expression, uh, it hurts with conversation. And we want royal demeanor and... We want royal demeanor and conversation way, 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 way more. So we want to be cheerful, lonely, and yielding. Which, I believe, cheerful, lonely, and yielding. Playing with toys exclusively makes me a very prime candidate for this. So now we are quite sad. We're going to min-max the hell out of this princess. So, in the meantime, we've got both of these up to 15. I'm going to call that good enough. What do we put some efforts into? Well, actually, easy answer. We don't have any big bonuses unless I want to go into agility, but I don't think we have any major agility. Oh, we do. We do actually... Uh, we have... a. We do have a test for reflexes. Requires 20. Um, for the snake. I kind of want to fail that. Because... Hmm. That's tough. Because we could also... We could work on our flexibility. But I'm thinking accounting and trade. Because if I remember right, there's one for accounting and trade fairly early on. Production and trade... Probable value, 50. So, in that case, I think we just gotta really start studying both. Let's go economics, economics. We are going to be very good at trade. I'm just gonna get it up to 50 for now. Probably. It's gonna take a while, is the one downside. Okay, so we've got her. I don't know if I care too much, so we're just gonna let her stay. Because I know she adds some level of extra drama that I don't want to deal with. Okay. So let's take a look. Skills. We do not have any big bonuses yet. Faith. Mystical. If I want to go that direction. And once again, agility. But I want to see what happens when I get by, bit by the snake. Because if I die, that's going to be really interesting. Oh, I probably should have saved before this. But whatever. Okay. So we are going to look down. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. So I wonder if we... I wonder if we specifically need low composure, high reflexes for that one. Oh, and I was maybe going to look into poison. Shoot, do we want to go back for that? Maybe. What is, in, what is intrigue affected by again? Needs me to be... Needs me to be willful. Unfortunately, I think mood-wise, we are becoming yielding. Shoot. Because we, we do actually need intrigue. 
don't we? And we're currently at a pretty deep negative if I want to go that direction. Because what we need is history, intrigue, and conversation. And, and royal demeanor. I, we're never going to be able to get everything. I think I'm just going to own this. Uh, so, um, okay, how the hell do we have a bonus to economics? We shouldn't. Unless economics provides its own bonuses. It does. That's different. So apparently for economics, 10% of your economics, your total economic score turns into a bonus for economics. I That's different. Okay. In that case, we're, we're going to ignore the snake event. I'm not going to think about it. We could use some points in foreign intelligence or court manners. Um, so I might actually put a little bit into court manners. And then we'll start working on accounting. Or maybe production. Okay, royal royal demeanors? No, conversation, court manners. And then production. It doesn't really matter. Okay, let's take a look at this. Okay, they're gone. She's sad. Yeah, test for poison failed. Hmm. Or unless that was week four. Shoot, I don't remember. Unless, of course, foreign intelligence court, court manners comes later, or a bit. Doesn't matter. Gonna keep... Do we keep playing with toys? Or lonely, lonely and cheerful. So in retrospect, messing around in the garden might actually work just about as well. Because once again... Oh, willful is good for intrigue, bad for economics. No, no, no. So... Why don't we mess with the gardens for the time being? Rather than anything else. Uh, that way I can scoot back up the mood bar. Because I don't want to actually be terribly yielding. It doesn't really provide me many benefits. Because yielding, yielding gives me bonuses to royal demeanor. Oh, history and faith. Ah, damn. Yeah, so intrigue and history are almost kind of complete opposites here. That's hard to work with, so I guess we should play with the dolls. Oh, min max. Unfortunately, remembering all this stuff is hard. Okay, but we can now go back to court manners. Honestly, uh, salty run back, salty run back. Because can't go wrong with court manners, and once again, working on our economics is good. Okay. Foreign intelligence failed, foreign affairs failed. But not appropriate to wear it. Okay. So we're not going to wear it. And do we just keep playing with toys so I can... Oh. Yeah, the only immediate problem is if I want to turn right back around and start working on... Uh, hit, going from history to intrigue is a pain in the butt. What do we need more of? What are foreign... Ah, uh, I need to color code my my thing better. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, let's play with bear. Okay. So, my intrigue, uh, which includes internal affairs and whatnot, is a bit of a downer. And my reflexes are bad. I'm just gonna kinda stay the course. We're gonna, we're gonna push economics a bit further. This is week six. Week six has climbing, which we're not going to be able to get. I'll leave that for later. And, if I remember right, this one is just... this is minor. Like I said, I looked up a little bit of a guide for a couple of these, so I know what some of them do. Um, well, I don't think I'm going to need court manners for a little while. So when we go all in on economics for a bit, let's do production and accounting. Okay. So we have the priestess hinting about, hey, do magic. We don't do magic. What is my mood right now? I'm yielding. Unsurprisingly. Okay. 
So I'm going to have to squander a shot here. Wait, no, no. Maybe if I don't. If I do accounting first and then trade, I think we'll be good. Okay. Uh, let's see. Pile of linen. Elegance reflexes. But court manners success. Uh, let's see. Scepter apology. There's also apparently reputation with these people. So that one is, uh, let's see. Made collision. I'm curious about internal affairs and why that would show up. Uh, I should probably go back and double check it. Oh, well, doesn't matter. Also, I just realized it's actually really easy to boost Willful comparatively because all we have to do is sneak out a bunch and we get it. Uh, and I'm cheerful now, which is good. It's good. Okay. So if I want to do, I just got to take a look at this. Logistics and trade on week 25 has one more. And then there's another one that requires 30. So I'm, I'm good on that one. But yeah, there's, there's one more at... We did that production and trade. Legit ah, I've already lost it. Logistics and trade. Week 25 had a failure at 45. I've got traded to 50, 57. What I could do is... Because we're on week 8. Week 8... Don't have much to work with. Oh, that's interesting. So the bonus up here is also a 10% of whatever, whatever our maximum bonus is. So we actually get a plus 0.125 on all intellectual just because of economics. Again, hadn't really noticed that. But now I'm paying attention. So other things that I could use, court manners would be good. Um, we could put some into foreign affairs, but that's kind of eh. I, I think our best bet bets are economics, but then also uh, public... I don't think public speaking shows up much. I know court manners and flattery are a lot more common. Uh, let's see. Yeah, public speaking, I think, is only for the parade? And maybe something else. Whereas flattery shows up four times, and court manners shows up nine. So we really, really, really want to push uh, court manners as high as it, we can go. So why don't we do... Why don't we do trade and court manners? Because I know trade shows up again. So conversation, court manners, and trade. There we go. Okay, and somebody was saying read these. They seem useful, but I'm just not going to retain them. Okay. Okay, so production plus trade equals success. So, what week is this? This is this one. So this is the printing press. Okay. I wonder if it's both. Like, the two of them added together, maybe? So it's got a much lower pass uh, threshold than I think it does. So maybe I don't need to... Don't need to push economics nearly as hard as I have. Uh, let's see. So yeah, we're going to invest into this, and I'm just going to keep goofing and childing. So, next order of business. I can do one more in trade. Once again, I know it shows up again, and if I have that max, maybe we don't need to think about it. Uh, and then we need to start working on flattery and some other stuff. Anything else getting a bonus? Athletics, if I want to go that direction. I know climbing and swimming, I think climbing doesn't show up often. Climbing shows up a couple of times, fails at a 50. So actually having a higher climbing is not the worst idea while I'm here. It's something. I, I think I'm still going to get my, my trade up one more and start working on flattery. Okay. So unfortunately, we don't know anything about these. Okay, so foreign affairs and military, this is...
both of those. And he gets flirty. Boy, not having foreign affairs is really rough at this point. I'll keep that in mind. That it might actually be better to be willful this early on. Rather than uh, good at court manners. Because I think most of the court manners requirements are actually really, really low. Uh, I didn't even see him go by, either. But I'm, I'm looking at the next couple things in his foreign affairs and Novan history. So maybe we start sneaking out. Maybe we should have been sneaking out a long time ago. Because, <sighs> yeah, I, I could invest into history. Okay, so we don't need any more on trade. Outfit-wise, by the way, tuxedo, boost at economics. All right, let's be dapper. Uh, so that gives us 100 trade. Hopefully, we never need to touch that again. That's one of the things I want to test, because there's like a hospital later on, and it's like, well, if I have 100 trade, is that just enough to pass every economics test in the rest of the game? I'm hoping as such. So let's go public, public, speak, yeah, public speaking and flattery. Okay. So we don't know the history here. Offer money. Okay. We're just going to cash money our way through this. Okay, so we've cash moneyed through it. So this was foreign affairs, foreign affairs, and foreign intelligence, internal affairs, but also there's one more for... Let's just do economics. And probably, well, success was 100. So this is the Ixion territory. Yeah, I just want to I just want to be very clear about all of these so I know how to plan for them because the Ixion territory conflict isn't really that big of a deal. If you fail it, you don't die. The problem is if you piss off Banyan too much uh, or the foreigners too much, foreigners invade, Banyan kills you. And then I think there's another one where you have like a commoner revolt, which I kind of don't want to deal with. So, uh, upcoming, we're still kind of in a mediocre spot. There's not a lot of things that I can do. Um, Because, yeah, we need history. We've needed history for a while. What what do we... What, what gives us history? History is yielding. And I'm already going willful, so whoopsie. Yeah, I, th I think in the future what I want to do is rush yielding as fast as possible, rack up history quick as can be, and then switch back around and actually start investing in intrigue. Or reverse. I'm, otherwise, economics actually does provide an easy out. Uh, so I guess I don't need to worry about that too much. So when we do one more into flattery and public speaking, get those kind of out of the way up to 50. And I'll probably go for the socialite outfit. Okay, Keithong, we know nothing about this. I know that's like its own arc. But it's something I will deal with later. Okay, so let's switch our outfit. Let's do tea dress. We are a sad socialite today. Oh, but that's okay. So what do we start investing in? Because unfortunately, we're kind of in a weird spot where nothing... Where we're only good at learning conversation. Which is good. And I think we're going to get it... We're going to be getting willful up pretty quickly. So, I don't know. Um, I guess let's do court manners and flattery. Max those two out. I don't think I'm going to bother with public speaking. Oh. Okay. Oh. That was an interesting one. Uh, 
I mean, we want to sneak out. I got to check the logs. That was a uh, er, return log. Okay. So that was week 12. Oh, it doesn't actually... It doesn't actually list what check it was. Shoot. Okay. So it was herbs plus battlefield medicine. I really wish there was a way that I could actually check all of these te tests. And I need to pay more attention to cross-reference them a little bit. Okay, so it's now week 13? That's interesting. I have no idea how this handles things. So do we want to do... Ah, do we even care? I might not. Oh, yeah, we even had a bonus for herbs and battlefield medicine. Maybe I should have invested into those. Mm, ba, 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 da. Oh, it actually looks like that 10% bonus uh, is actually just for everything. Economics included, but not alone. So, I could go for a big, big old boost to conversation. Uh, one last time, max that out and start working on something completely different, which is not the worst idea. I gotta double check. Does Battlefield show up anywhere else? No. Yeah, uh, chances are this set of spreadsheets just is not accurate. If anybody actually wants to help this uh, and or has better information to help fill this out, I am all ears. I am, I am very amenable to that sort of thing. So I think the real answer here is we just might want to start investing towards things even with a bonus because right now I could put more into conversation but I don't think it's going to help me too much I think we're pretty peaked out and so what I probably want to do is like Novan history or like expression we get a bonus to both so it's not too too bad because, yeah, I think we're kind of working on royal demeanor. Because demeanor requires yielding, not willful. Shoot. Willful is only good for intrigue. I think I'm barking up the wrong tree. I mean, okay, it's still good, but... Shoot. <laughs> uh, I turned around at the ab absolute wrong time. Because, yeah, mood-wise, we're about to hit willful... And I'm realizing that that was a mistake. Hmm. Oh, that's a humdinger. I guess we could just start doing athletics. Athletics is affected by cheerful and pressured. Am I not cheerful anymore? Oh, I think we've lost that a bit. That sucks. Yeah, let's just start working on a, either athletics or, like, weapons. Because I know sword was kind of useful last time. Oh, but no, reflex, reflexes and... Uh, let's do reflexes and f flexibility. Start pushing those a little bit. They don't give me too big of a boost, but it's there. Okay, so this is the murder. So... This was Novan history. Day 13. Okay. Murder trial. Unfortunately, not great at this. Okay. So we know all of this. Internal affairs, once again. Murder trial. If I put her to work. Okay. So it's all murder trial. If I had imprisoned her and I'd done archery, I think I would have been, been able to bonk her. But I didn't... I don't have that. So, uh... I guess the real answer is... Oh. Oh, that's how we lost Cheerful and became lonely. Well, it's fine. Time to be willful, which means we can start investing in intrigue. Little, uh... Goofed on that one, because what we really needed... Um, what we've really needed is other things. We've kind of missed our opportunity for intrigue for a while and kind of needed history. 
Yeah, that's uh, that's a big whoops. Yeah, because it's way way better to go for royal demeanor and history rather than intrigue. Looking at this list, I think intrigue is still good. It just ain't the same. Um, I guess I'll try and figure out how to become cheerful as well. So why don't we do classes, internal affairs? And foreign intelligence. We're going to need both of those. Ciphering, to my knowledge, is useless. Okay, divination failed. Oh, falconry success, but I didn't read what it said because I thought it was fine. Okay. So let's go back to trying to become cheerful for that other boost. If I can. Though it really is only your current mood that affects these things. And then whatever your accumulated skill boost is. Which is good. Don't get me wrong. So I think I might want to uh, put a little bit more into intrigue. Just to get internal affairs, foreign intelligence up. Um... But then I think I might try and cap cheerful and then start push, pushing yielding again. This whole loop back was a mistake. Okay, there's the gala. Gala. Okay, oh. Strategy failed. Okay. I don't remember this. Let's do poems praising your mother for the time being. Okay, and then this is Bryony as well. Shoot. I should probably read this a bit more, but is what it is. So, lonely and cheerful. So now, hopefully, no, cheerful ain't maxed out. It's because I think we keep uh, depressing ourselves with things, which is not the most helpful. Yeah, same deal. Okay, so they both max out at 50. Should be fine. Okay, will you be leading the parade? I think I have good speech. Okay, so decoration here is parade. Oh. And there's another one for public speech, which I failed. Okay, so I, I screwed that one up, but I don't think the parade is anything other than something that makes the populace happy. Maybe. I think there's also stuff for elegance and faith. Oh, depending on what I picked, maybe. Oh, well. Okay. Uh, let's start. Let's start doing that. Because now we're cheerful again. Dang. Yeah, 40, 48 conversation is not, not enough for the public speech. But I don't know if the public speech is actually that important. However, looking at this, we do have a bonus to athletics. So now's a good time. Let's just do athletics, athletics. All in on climbing. Because I think we have another climbing thing coming soonish. And failed on a 20, so might need like 30 or something. Get really good at it. Okay, and we've got the ball. Which I suck at. Now, there's a very real possibility I just do not have these. And I look super trash. But at least intriguing court manners. Uh, so I might actually be able to pick someone. Okay. Kegel's not named any of his son as his official heir. Second son, Lindley, was always kind to you at school. Elath held regency for young Lord Adair, who's only 12 and head shorter than you are. Elath is a rich territory and at least little Adair wouldn't try and take any liberties. Banian could be awkward if... He didn't actually want to marry him. He's been waiting for, uh, years for a powerful heiress to accept his suit. Not all nobles are created equal. You could choose someone charming and unimportant, like the Earl of Mima. 
A territory too minor for anyone to consider a threat. However, major families might eat him alive afterwards. Okay. Wow. These are some options. Let's go with Lindley. Unfortunately, I suck at dance. But at least my court manners and flattery are good. Well, I didn't screw up and they're not killing me, so that's a good sign. Uh, let's see. So Gwinnell, for instance, young lady of Sudbury, only months older than you and due to inherit control of her duchy. Or Adele, youngest daughter of Duchess Lila and fierce sportswoman. She is a few years ahead of you and is absolute terror at the ball fields. No Bryony. She's at school. Okay, so we've seen this. I, I really wish there was a highlight saying like, hey, you've done this before or not. Okay, and cousins aren't here. But nothing on sense, sense magic. So all of this is just gala. Okay, so intriguing court manners and court manners and flattery. Uh, we succeeded with flying colors. I'm going to say like 50. Probably is a probable answer. Uh, unfortunately, my, my court manners is very, very high. I'm just going to... Uh, so I'm going to just put them down as like I passed it with 80 plus. Okay, so we were going to work on yielding. Yeah, we're going to go back to playing with toys. Because looking at this now, intrigue is useful and worthwhile. I will say economics so far hasn't proven itself to be particularly amazing and I could probably skip it. Um, athletics probably isn't that big. What else do we have? Not much. What about moods? It's gonna take a while to get any of this going. Shoot. Well, what do we have coming up? Composure. Well, I could actually start working on my royal de demeanor regardless. Because we have composure, presence. Ah, but I'm not gonna pass any of those. Or flexibility, which, yeah, I'm not gonna pass either. Intrigue I might be fine on. So why don't we do one more in climbing and start working on swimming? I'll just work on athletics. Okay. So father has a companion. False flattery, which we're good at. We absolutely wreck her. Uh, let's see. Nice woman. Nothing more. It's not going to happen anytime soon. Need to be careful with how you deal with people like Siren. You need the goodwill of your nobles as well as your commoners. Uh, let's see. As queen, you must be aware of everything around you. Isn't that what I have agents for? Okay. So what is our greatest concern? Um, Honestly, assassins. I'll have to work on that. Uh... But I'll take guards. Okay, and we're going to go back to messing with this. Looks like our mood has shifted. We are now afraid. Afraid gives us a completely different setup. Uh, if I remember right, afraid is kind of useless. Does give me a boost to agility, which is good. Is, it, is that the only thing it gives a bonus to? Uh, mystical as well, but I'd, I, I'm staying away from magic for the time being. So... We could go all in on flexibility for a bit with this bonus, sure. I'm gonna make the most of this. Okay, let's try 53 flexibility. Oh, and budget time. Oh, that's interesting. So that accounting is for So at 19 is the um, is the accounting test for raising or lowering taxes. Uh, interesting that I had a partial failure on it, but it doesn't really matter too much. That's more useful if I want to um, piss off certain factions, which, you know, there are going to be times when I want to do that. 
So I'm still afraid. God, afraid is like the least useful mood, to be honest. It's good if I want to work on my physical, and I kind of do. We just... Dance isn't that good, and we've already kind of missed our mark on that one. It's good for reflexes. For certain things. Actually, maybe I want to get my reflexes up. Okay, we can now play sports on the weekends. Okay. And this is the man that murdered his wife. Let's execute him this time. Because if I remember right, he escaped previously, which actually wasn't great. So I could get rid of... Okay, so I could lose Angry and Lonely and become... Ah, uh, is it time actually? Because Angry... well... Because it's angry to afraid. Afraid boosts agility and faith. Whereas angry gets me weapons and military, if I want to go that direction. And then losing lonely makes me pressured. Pressured is good for athletics and faith. Hmm. Neither of those are that good. And I think we wanted to work on becoming more yielding, which in retrospect, I should have been attending court this entire time. Shoot. Oop. Okay, so we can still work on physical, and we can still work on our climbing and a couple other things. Boy, being afraid is, like, the least useful. Uh, so let's do one into dance and running. Okay. Yep. So... Uh, what week are we on? I've lost all sense of this. Because I haven't been paying that much attention. Okay, I think that was actually 20, so that was the murderer. Which I feel like might come back to haunt me. Secret Cabal of Evil Lumen, Sacrifice Innocence. Which I think is actually true. Based on what I remember. Oh, why did I do that? I was supposed to become more yielding faster. Because otherwise it's just taking too damn long. Uh, salty run back, salty run back. Oops, don't mean to do that. I should probably save more often, but eh. Okay. Fabian, Earl of Titan, has passed away. Okay, so what to do with a dare? Send him to his grandfather. There's a thing that I can do with that, and it might screw screw me over, or it might not. We will see. Okay, so what is my mood? Still pretty afraid. Getting there on yielding. Okay, so we also have a 2-2. That sure is an outfit there. Let's just do the tea dress. Okay. So where, where are we at on this? Well, if I want to keep working on uh, any of these, we're good. So maybe one more on swimming, and then one more on reflexes. Okay. And we have the musician. Unfortunately, well... Okay, so we don't actually get the spy. I don't actually know if the spy does anything. Okay, and we also have exercise gear. Yep, that sure is an outfit. I'm gonna keep the uh, tea dress on just because conversation is kind of useful. <sighs> Should maybe put like one more point into that at some point, but still. Um, any other big bonuses that we're looking at here? No. Yeah, the problem is being afraid afraid for this long has really put me in kind of a an awkward state.
Because it's not really that useful. Oh, did 21 come and go? So I guess, oh. So climbing has come and gone. We missed that. Um, okay, so this is the uh, Bard Spy event. I'm bad at filling this in. Bard Spy. And we've got another one for logistics and trade. I, I'm hoping we're fine. Um, I don't want to invest more into that unless I absolutely have to. The hell is logist logistics? Oh, logistics is under military. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Well, seeing as my boost is so damn high, uh, let's just do... Eh, let's do one in climbing and one in reflexes. Because reflexes seem like they might be good. Okay. So the boy is happy. I'm gonna keep working on being yielding. Mood... Okay, so now I have to stop being afraid. So, uh, one into climbing. Maybe one into trade? It's week 25. Max out trade so we don't have to worry about it? Sure. Okay. And it was cli climbing? Because I don't think we're going to need more reflexes than this. Okay. And learn more about trade. And we have... What? Wow. I failed on a hundred. So I need high logistics. This is Falling Star. Even with a hundred trade, it was not enough. Damn. Whatever that event is, it requires some serious... Uh, configuration. So, we've learned trade is pretty much useless to me unless I do certain things. Let's do some sports. So now we are properly yielding, I think. Yes. Which means we can now finally gain some bonuses to Intrigue, History, and uh, Royal Demeter. Actually, this works out pretty perfectly across the board. The only thing we're really losing out on is Lumen. And I don't really care. Like I said, I don't really truck with magic yet. I will. Uh, so we're week 26. What are we going to need? We are going to need Novan History above 50, which doesn't seem particularly doable. And actually, it looks like there's uh, nothing else to... Uh, I'm not going to need it for a while. Shoot. Goofed this one. All right, let's do uh, let's do history then. Novan history, foreign affairs. Okay, Adair has been assassinated. Shot with a crossbow while playing on the grounds on his grandfather's estate. Where are the guards? This is not the first time this has happened within the realm of Ishtar. Earl of Ishtar's first wife and oldest daughter also died under mysterious circumstances. Then his other daughter married young and died giving birth to Adair. With Adair dead, the only family has left is his second wife and their son Connor, who's 15. Well, blame the Earl of Ishtar. Execute him. Okay, uh, let's see, so, dang. Which week is this? Matter of the Duchy of Elath. By the by blood, the nearest living heir is Talaris, Duke of Sedna in Talas. He's not even no Novin. There's a lot of internal affairs. That is not on my list. Oh, they don't know because they didn't send the boy over. Okay. So what week was this? I have no idea. So that was week 26. Yeah, none of those were involved. Shoot. Well, I think I might have to go back and uh, fill out this spreadsheet a bit. Okay, so there were like... There were like four, 
four tests in there and none of them were tracked. That's a pain. Well, I don't know. I just got to make do. So question is, take a look at skills. Flattery is pretty high. Everything is pretty good. I'm very disappointed by economics. It hasn't been worth it. So investing towards that was kind of a waste. Uh, let's see. Do we want to keep working on... I mean, Novin and Foreign Affairs seems like a really good idea to keep pushing. Okay. And I know... I know this is actually kind of useful. Okay, letters for you. Letter from Bryony. Okay, and there's Gwinnell's party. We'll go to the party. Okay, so that's divination. Gwinnell party portent. I'm just trying to label these well so that when it comes down to... Or... When it comes time to figure out where I stand on these things... I can work around them. Wow! My weapon skills are deep in the negatives. Well, it's okay. I don't need them yet. I don't know. Did we put two points into... Because, yeah, it's 28. I guess let's do world history. There's a test on the 28th for Novan history, but it fails on a 50. So it's kind of pointless. Okay, so this is why we had bandits, or not bandits, extra guards. Uh, let's see, Gwinnell's party is lovely. Not nearly as glamorous as your own upcoming birthday party will be, but it's still a major event on a noble, notable, or on the noble social calendar. Everyone who is anyone is present. Except for the new du Duke of Elath. Matters there are too unsettled to be left unattended. Uncle Lawrence and her younger cousins are here, but Charlotte and her mother are not. Apparently Charlotte was ill. Aris, Duchess of Lila, is present, but she somehow always manages to avoid talking to you when you draw near. The refreshments and dancers and musicians and polite conversations. And one or two not so polite. Okay, so they're they're fighting again. Okay, so I can flatter them both. So flattery is um, party argument. Oh, this is probably the bandit attack. The uh, There's an archery or reflex test uh, when the bandits attack, but since I had extra guards, I didn't have to worry about it. Okay. So this is Bryony talking about the old palace. Okay, so she's probably going to disappear there. Well, that was easy. Same thing with... Lore. Okay. So, more sports? Yeah, let's take a look at this. Ah, uh, yeah. So I think at this point we just want to continue to get angry so I can get good at, at fighting. Um, we're never going to have a high expression, but maybe we don't need it. I'm thinking foreign affairs and world. I'm just going to ignore these. See if I can get by without. Okay. Matters have come to a crisis, Aris. Duchess of Lila. Aris, Duchess of Lila has declared civil war. What? She feels that you're a weak leader, unfit to be queen, and has managed to sway several others to her banner. Who is against me? Uh, Duchess of Mead and Duke, Duke of Kigal. Okay. So the... Ah, the printing facility is useful here. Um, so this might be under strategy and some other stuff. Uh, let's see. So this is... The printing machine might be useful. If the soldiers read these, they might change their minds. 
Okay. Pardon for various imprisoned criminals in exchange for military services. That seems like a iffy thing, but sure. Okay. So we definitely not need to continue to get angry. Okay, boost conversation, agility, history. Probably better than speaking. So, military, not great at the moment. And this whole Civil War thing is a bit of a downer because I'm not quite prepped for it. So do we want to do Novan and World Affairs? Or Novan and Foreign Affairs again? Okay, Negotiator for the Rebels has arrived to speak with you. Okay. Asking for our, uh, asking for our surrender. Marry one of Duchess Arisa's sons. She'll become your regent and guide the domain to stability. Okay, suggest a compromise. Okay. Shoot. That was public speaking, but I don't know what day I'm on. It might be like 30-ish. Uh, let's see. This is Civil War Compromise. Well, I could just surrender. That'd be funny. But no, let's refuse. We've got battle. Unfortunately, I freaking suck at battle. So I'm probably just going to get killed here, but is what it is. <sighs> you know how I ignored public speaking because I didn't think it was important? Whoopsie. Yeah, so that was uh, week 30. I should really be saving more often. But yeah, looking at my stats, the economics was mildly helpful, but not majorly. History would have been really, really good early, uh, but now that I've invested it into it late, it's meaningless. Intrigue is useful, once again, very early. Both of these are better to focus on first. Royal Demeanor is shockingly kind of pointless. Uh, and Conversation has some big bonuses here and there. Ah. Uh, well... I guess I'm just going to go all in on strategy. It's probably not, it's probably too late. Okay. So we are once again imprisoned. Dang. And I could load back, but none of these are helpful. Except for the, like, the autos. Oh. Interesting. There's auto saves. Oh, and there's different. Wow, there's a lot of pages for this. This is actually kind of useful. Uh, so there's no test on that one. So what time is it? It's 8:40. So if I go back here. Okay, so military failed. Uh, it's not part of the cr criminals. I don't think that's going to matter too much. Uh, I'm going to continue to get angry. Here's the thing. Conversation, conversation. We're going to do double public speaking. Okay. We succeeded. If we come to blows, there will be no true winner. Good soldiers will die. Property will be devastated. The victor's rule will be tainted with blood. I'm young, and perhaps the Duchess's wisdom would be useful to me as an advisor, not regent. To work together for the good of Nova. Terms are acceptable. We'll main control, maintain control of our forces in order to prevent misunderstandings. Well, we're not dead, so that's huge. Okay, so let's go back to being angry. We're still... I don't know, we're still whatever. Let's save over this. It doesn't really matter. Okay, good, I don't have to name it. I probably should, but... Uh, my, my thoughts are... 
What I'd like to do is kind of figure out an, an ideal build to start with, which is what I've been kind of testing out here. Because if I can figure out an ideal build to go through this game, then we can save at kind of key moments and branches and decide to go like this way or that. So if I want to go Civil War and win, you know, go full Warlord, I know there's a way to do it. And I bet, I bet I could kind of like mix and match and go from either Warlord to Peacekeeper to like Extreme Fight Princess, who knows. Either way, uh, let's go back to Novan and Foreign Affairs for these things. They're a little late overall because I really should have invested them a long time ago, but that's okay. Okay. Oh, right. Um, I think it was uh, 75. It's either 50 or 75 for that public speaking thing. This is the gust of wind. I might actually die here. We'll see what happens. Okay, the Duchess of Lila and her retinue arrive at the castle to take their new places as your ministers and advisors. So much to your surprise, Aris has not brought your new fiancé with you. With her. My intent is for you to wed my youngest son, Thaddeus, as he's closest to your age. He's a fragile boy and unwell at the moment. Remember Thaddeus vaguely from school, and fragile is not the word you would have used to describe him. Angry, unpredictably violent, often in trouble and a terrible scholar, but not fragile. He's going to be your husband? Okay. Huh. When he was young, he saw something no child should. Oh! Engaged to Thaddeus. That's interesting. Can I look at... Oh, I can look at lore for these characters. I will not speak of it, neither should you. Do not ask me, do not ask him. If he chooses to someday tell you his story, then perhaps it'll help... Uh, that will help him, but it must be his choice. I want this marriage to be good for him. What about good for me? She doesn't care. Too late to change your mind now. Boop. Well, it's okay. Continue to be angry. Shit has gone poor. Mood. Now we're still not max, max angry. We're still pretty yielding. Uh, let's see. I'm thinking Novin and World. I don't know what else I got. Actually, maybe swimming. Swimming in world. Okay, things have been unsettled lately. Everyone's on edge. We need something cheerful. Hold a tournament. What a good idea. Okay, will you offer prizes? Uh, employment. Okay, as you move through the hall, he's... Fall, uh, your eyes fall upon a vase of flowers. Pretty, but apparently not getting enough water. Okay, that's divination and decoration. So this is the withered flowers. Someone in the hall's hall duty is being lazy. The flowers should be replaced. Okay, maid's waiting for you. We've got a gift from Kigal. Okay, chocolate producers in Kigal usually ship goods down the Napo River through Ursul, not straight to the capital. The, this merchant house probably specializes in something else and only traded for the chocolate. Little card with a box with our compliments, the house of Krilat. There's something suspicious about this. So, test for dogs is, I think this is all poison. There's something suspicious about this. Uh, well, I could eat the candy now, which would be funny. Uh, but we'll leave it for later. I'll inevitably get poisoned at some point. And think of a way to test the chocolates. Don't want to leave it lying around. You bury it. But we don't get poisoned. Good enough. Alright. Sports. I don't remember exactly what gets tested at the tournament. But I'm thinking maybe if I just max out climbing, that'll be good enough. I could also, well, do we save? I'll save in case, because I could potentially max out a skill, or at least bring it up enough. Uh, so, tournament-wise, I mean, climbing is pretty good. So, I could do climbing and swimming. It looks like, once again, we're stuck yielding forever. Uh, we also have dancing, if I want to go that direction. Let's just do one in climbing and one in swimming. Okay, this is the week of the general tournament. Nobles and commoners alike have turned out to compete against each other. 
Okay. The people will not be pleased if their promised queen makes a poor showing of herself. Do what you can. Uh, do only what you can do well. What do you want to do? Oh, mounted parade, jousting, fencing, archery, music, falconry. Jeez, I was expecting there'd be more than this. This mounted parade. Horses, elegance, well, screwed that one up. Maybe it'll be fine. I don't know. I mean, we're on week 34. That's usually a good sign. I'm probably going to get murdered by something. I've never gotten this far. Uh, it's time to find out. Okay, so what are we at skills-wise? Climbing is maxed. Swimming is pretty high, and I don't think we need any more. What do we even have left? Uh, I'm looking at my list. Foreign intelligence, world history, court manners. So, let's put foreign intelligence and let's max out our court manners oh foreign intelligence is an intrigue thing uh. okay Okay, someone's coming. It's urgent. You find your father standing over a map of the coastline, his face grave. The Duchess of Lila is present as well. This must be serious. Ships have been sighted on approach from Shanjia. Not trade ships. This is a war fleet. What? Within a week, they could be in Novan waters. Within two, they could reach the capital. Fight to defend ourselves. You could try to use the treasury funds to hire additional soldiers, but it may be difficult on short notice. Sure. You'll need to draw up a naval strategy for our ships to carry out. You could choose to act as admiral and lead the free fleet in person but the danger could you to you could be very great she must not it would be far too easy for an accident to befall her far from the shore okay unless you think your personal skills will make the difference i would strongly advise against it stay in the capital now there's too much to do here i can't go to sea do your best and novus will survive okay uh i no we're still not maxed on angry well that's unfortunate Oh, I should have been maybe focused on some other things. Well, on the plus side. Oh, this is probably. Uh, swimming is probably for the strategy and naval strategy, which I said no on. Uh, and didn't feel like doing. And because I didn't do that. Um. I didn't have to get tested for swimming. Okay, let's let's save over this one. Because I might be able to push a little bit further into foreign intelligence and world history. Uh, so let's do foreign intelligence and history. My world history is pretty dang good, but I could push it a little further. Same thing with foreign intelligence. Okay, so foreign intelligence up, up to 69. World history is almost maxed. Let's see what this gets me. Danger on the high seas. Ships are closing in on each other, angling into range. The Shenjians have half again as many troops as you do. Doesn't look promising. The eventual outcome is not your favor. The Novan ships are sunk or scattered as the Shenjian forces press towards landfall. Many good soldiers were lost today, and Nova's troubles have not ended. Since you failed to repel the invasion, the Shenjian fleet will soon land, their troop, uh, land, and their troops will begin progress towards your capital city. Your remaining soldiers will hold them off for as long as possible, of course. The main strength of your military has been exhausted. Nova's future looks bleak. Oh boy. Okay, we are now angry. Problem is, it's really freaking late in the game for me to get angry. I need to get angry much, much sooner. Um, yeah, this was a wash. I don't think we even used any of these. Um, let's see. So I'm thinking we do... Let's probably keep pushing foreign intelligence. Maybe court manners and foreign intelligence.
Okay. The invasion of Novu is proceeding. Your coastline is under Shenjian control. Soldiers have marched through villages, trampling fields and frightening citizens. A diplomatic delegation from Shenji has requested access to the castle to d discuss terms, most likely for your surrender. You lack the strength to hold off their armies. The surrounding now will save many lives. It seems you have no choice. You prepare yourself as best as you can to meet the representatives from Shenjia. You expected diplomats and military and a military representative, a general or an, or an admiral. You did not expect the handsome man decked in jewels who now stands before you, a man announced by your servants as Tagami, king of Shenjia. Is he really their king? Are you serious? Why would a king come all the way here? I failed both of those. And they're like really high. Holy shit. Um... Oh, I don't know what day it is. Okay, the sense magic is uh Well, we'll see how this goes. My dear young lady, how difficult this must be for you. So much responsibility at such a tender age. Okay, court manners. Composure failed, court manners success. You yearn to slap the false sympathy off his oily face, but you force yourself to remain calm. War benefits no one, don't you think? Such a terrible way is better to settle things in a civilized manner. A contest, a game, so to speak, with Nova at the stakes. Should I win, then your domain will submit and accept me as overlord with no further resistance. Should I lose, then my army will leave your domain in peace and shed no more blood. Sort of game. It's well known that Nova is ruled by Lumens. As it happens, I possess the power of a Lumen. Propose a formal duel. My power's against yours. The winner takes control of Nova. The loser dies. But I'm not a Lumen. Saving it, it for the coronation, were you? Such a pity you were unprepared. Well then, go, fi go and find your crystal. Becoming a Lumen is a very simple matter. Then we can have our duel. What's the point? You know I can't win. Why don't you just kill me now? Because that's not the game. You want to save your people, don't you? I want to fight a Lumen. If you refuse, then a war will continue. I'll sweeten the deal. If you meet me in a formal Lumen challenge, I'll call off the invasion even if I win. Really? Swear by the gods, Nova will be free and safe. Why take the risk? You're winning the war. It's not your land I want, it's your crystal. To gain your power, I'm willing to wager, wager my own. Shall we begin? Okay, don't like this, but what choice do I have? Well, we could also offer a marriage... Uh, marriage alli alliance. Uh, well, I've saved. What if I marry you instead? Then everything I have is yours as well. Okay. Okay, well. You want to fight the Lumen ruler of Nova? Father reaches into his pocket and pulls out a shimmering blue crystal, which he places over his heart. Illuminate! Well, we'll see how this goes. Your hair stands on end as a veil of blue sparkles. A blue sparkle settles over your father, crawling into his skin. When it's over, the jewel has been absorbed into his body without a trace. Fight me, leave her alone. Well, this is not what I, was ex what I expected, but it'll serve my purposes just as well. Dad? Be quiet, Elodie. You are not a queen yet. You're forced to sit and watch as the two men work out the details of their duel and its stakes, then take their places in, carefully warded, in a carefully warded circle. Your father crosses his arms, summoning up a thick gray fog that swirls around him, hiding him from view. But the Shen Shenjian king conjures a cloud of glowing butterflies which dive, drive into the fog and blow it apart. The invader claps his hands together and chants. Fiery red lights cluster over his fingertips and merge together into a pulsing blob before erupting towards your father. He resists with a beam of blue, catching the infernal energy and pushing it back in Tagami's direction. You knew what the outcome would be. You knew it all along. Tagami is a trained lumen, eager to demonstrate his powers, and your father was your father. Plus ten depressed. Ouch. The blue crystal reappears, lying beside your father's body like an innocently discarded bauble. But now that blue color is, color color is colored by a faint wash of red. The sparking king of Shenjia sweeps the crystal off the floor, tucks it into his robes. How fitting. First I enter your mother's life, and then your father's. You what? You didn't think her death was an accident, did you? That took careful planning. And now the Novan power is mine, and you even get to live. He holds out his hand in front of him, the elegant robe dangling freely. Now kneel and kiss my hand. Not in a thousand years. With a scream, you launch yourself at the Shenjian king, prepared to go down fighting. Of course, it only takes a touch of his magic to end your life. Well, that didn't work. I got blasted by magic, I guess. Cool. Ouch. 
Uh, so things we learned, uh, <laughs> oh boy, go for intrigue early, not later. And maybe military strategy, also maybe magic. I don't know, I think there's a lot of different ways that that could have gone. I'm gonna go back though. I'm just gonna go all in on foreign intelligence if I can. And see if anything changes. Okay, so war failed, continue to get angry, too late. I know there's a way you can fight him without magic, which is also something that would be interesting, but not freaking lightly. So I guess one in court manners and foreign intelligence, which is now maxed. Okay, foreign intelligence success, king concert, he should be, even if that much. He's a common musician who married his way to the throne. Interesting. Unfortunately, I don't think anything else cha changes. Oh, sing to him. Unfortunately, I'm bad at singing. Okay, so same deal as last time. I get wrecked. Well, good to know. All right, cool. That was rough, but we've learned some things, uh, like what to what to build towards, and what's actually worth, uh, kind kind of. Uh, at least we've learned some stuff, and my my spreadsheet's getting a bit better. I wish I'd been filling things in, uh, based on my successes, because I just kind of passed them without thinking. Uh, but it's fine. Anyway, I think we might get close to winning the next one, especially if I spec military a bit. Uh, or a lot because economics really didn't help that much it got me the printing press and it could have gotten me like one other thing if I had gone for it um, but I think I might just skip that tree entirely because it wasn't that helpful whereas military would have been hella good but for now at least thank you all so much for watching I'll see you next time